Jessica, Ethan Nordeen can go back home. He's been in custody here at the Federal Detention Center in SeaTac. Prosecutors argued Nordeen would be a flight risk, but a judge said evidence presented during today's hearing wasn't convincing. Exactly one month after his arrest, a federal judge rules that the man accused of leading the Proud Boys into the U.S. Capitol on January 6th can go home until his trial in D.C. Ethan Nordine is the so-called Sergeant of Arms of the Seattle chapter of the Proud Boys, which the FBI has designated as an extremist group with ties to white nationalism. Investigators say photos show Nordine in the Capitol building and near the front of the crowd that overwhelmed Capitol Police. He's charged with obstruction, violent entry, and disorderly conduct on Capitol grounds. If convicted, he's facing more than 30 years in prison. Today, a federal judge ordered Nordine's release from the Federal Detention Center in SeaTac with conditions. He'll be restricted to his house. Firearms must be removed from his home and he cannot travel. The black cloud of the deadly attack by Trump supporters on the U.S. Capitol still hovers as federal authorities step up security after receiving information about another possible plot to breach the Capitol tomorrow. Possibility of a similar incident occurring in the current environment is a very clear and present danger. National security officials testified in D.C. today about the failures that allowed the insurrection to happen in the first place. Lawmakers hope that information, along with increased security, will prevent another attack on the Capitol. Live in SeaTac tonight, Britt Moore, King 5 News. Okay, Britt, thank you.